Alright guys, we are back. Back in the mix of the GTAs. I hope you're enjoying the Let's Plays. All the episodes, because there's a lot of them. In there. Actually, let's, you know what? We're done. We're switching to Franklin. Woohoo! I appreciate the comments and the ratings and stuff on the videos, guys. So, just know that I do notice. I do read the comments. Um, I appreciate it a lot. So, if you leave a like if you like the video, that's awesome. Appreciate hey, it. It's Franklin, man. I'm following the architect. All right. Don't fuck it up. All right. Don't fuck it up. He's gonna fuck it up. Hey, stupid! You can't be on here without a hat! Yeah, thanks a lot. Sweetness. Site inspection! Architect on site. He's totes not gonna notice me following him, that's for sure. I feel like, I feel like a stalker. Well, let's just see where he goes. Those idiots drilled the new caissons on the west side. You're kidding me. The bedrock ends there. We need caissons on the east side. Ah, uh, no drama. It's a government contract. We can pay until completion. I ain't taking a fall for this drill. <laughs> Hope you guys can hear it. Dude, am I supposed to fall him into this elevator? I'll go on my own elevator. Sup? You like my t shirt? Or my, not my t shirt. My shirt in the game? Look at that. Yeti. It's got a big foot. Or a Yeti on it. Man, this is really high. I'm scared. Oh, look. It's the great RT. Study him and study him hard. I was gonna wipe my ass on him. That's the engineer's plan. Mine you treat like a religious text, remember? Yeah, that's it. Where'd he go? Stun gun. Do I have a stun gun? I don't. I can just punch him. Who's that? <coughs> Fucked. See, I wouldn't want to be a. Uh... You know, just, you know, walking away from a crime scene where I beat a guy up and stole his stuff. And, you know, have a good day. I hope you guys have a great day. Bye. Sweetness. You don't look suspicious at all. Seems legit. Good shit, Franklin. You're the goat. Now where do I go? I'm gonna go get a car, I guess. I got oh, I have a nice life. That's what we're doing. That's all you need to know. We're making some big moves. Oh, Shiza. Sorry. I'm my bad on that one. Room, motherfucker. Michael's here. 
Do home here. Thank you. So, all good? Sure, homie. So is this shit for real? We just gonna rob the FIB and be allowed to walk by your boys like that? Yeah, I don't fucking know. Probably not. All right, Lester, what do you got? Uh, I don't quite know yet. Give me a minute. I'm not a fucking computer. Oh. Oh. Oh, maybe I am. <laughs> Here's what I think. We have two options. The new security software goes into containment mode in case of emergency, you know, uh, earthquakes, mudslides, acts of God. So we could plant some firebombs. They go bang, the emergency call goes out. We hijack it, show up as firemen, and then we grab the containment drive. Or we could hack the system on site. We'll go in by, uh, by air. Uh, hope we don't run into too much physical resistance. Sounds relaxing. Either bombing our office ran by a division of corrupt government psychos or defeating one of the world's most complex security systems using our worthless ass ninja skills, huh? Yeah. Any, many, money, mo. If you favor the firebomb containment drive option, you'll go in with that janitor's ID you picked up. It'll be at night when most of the workers are off. You mop the place and plant the bombs where we need them. Seriously? I got a mop? Yeah, yeah, you really do. They'll clock you on the cameras if you're play-acting. You also need a fire truck to show up in when the bombs go off, and a getaway car stashed in a quiet place near the bureau so you can torch the truck and get out. The car doesn't have to be anything special. There shouldn't be any heat. Well, what about the other way, with the uh, ninja skills? Now, you choose that route, you won't be using the janitor's gear, but we had to cover all the bases. Your FIB paymasters will have to provide you with a chopper and a pilot. Now, you fly way up above the building, parachute in, and gain access through the roof here. Now, you'll need to be armed to the teeth, mind you, just in case the, uh, shit goes down. Mopping or parachuting? Wow, you're making this choice really difficult. <laughs> now, Haynes has given us the leftover money from the Polito job to pull this mission, and the crew will be paid out of that. We keep the change. So, Yay. what's it gonna be? I mean, we gotta go in through the roof, right? I mean, I like the whole explosive thing, but parachuting through the roof? Of course. Now, you'll need a, a hacker, a gunman, and a driver. The hacker won't come in with you, but they'll help you break the system, talking you through the process from a remote location. Hmm. We could pick the good one, but she'll get more of the cut. So Harris, pick the good, one. <laughs> good feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got. Yeah, I don't know how long it'll take you to get into the network. The gunman's there to buy you the time you need. I mean, we are to use this guy. Gus Moda. He's a pro. Not much else to say. The driver will be waiting outside on getaway. They'll source a vehicle, so bear that in mind. Okay, we're picking this guy. Ah, okay. This one's new blood. I've seen him drive, but I haven't seen him under pressure. Okay, that all look good to you? You are robbing the FIB here. Hell yeah. Concern. And we have a winner. I'll make the arrangements and call you when we're ready. All right, shit, hit me. You know, um, I'm still looking into that Union Depository gig. It's real interesting. But I don't know if we can do it without you-know-who. Yeah, well, as long as he can't do it without us. Okay. <sighs> Damn, we about to go off on the heist. Quick getaway. What, because I'm not super fast? I mean, I wanted to, like, you know, go out slow. So I didn't arise any suspicion, really. That was my plan. Jerks. What else?